Oh, hi guys, how are you doing? Um, this is Dominic. Hi. He's uh, a beautiful soul who's come and joined us for a few weeks to help us build a roundhouse. So uh, this is what we're doing. I'm afraid to say it's been raining here a lot. No? A lot. A lot, the yeah. So the last week we've had constant rain, so we've had a bit of a, a delay in our construction time. But um, Dominic managed to gather all the materials which are behind us. And now we're going to do the next stage and hopefully we'll shore up the walls. And if we're lucky, we might even get the roof on today. We will see. <laughs> so enjoy the video and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll go from there. <laughs> see you later, guys. started to put the cross beams which will attach and then we have mounted the main beam for holding the mezzanine floor so we have the sleeping area. Um, as you can see we've done a little bit of joinery work and so as the beam puts pressure down on it it's going to uh, hold it all into place. Okay, what we're doing now is we're attaching the cross member beams in across the tops. Um, to do that, we're going to be drilling uh, with this hole saw into the upright beams, and that will give us a nice three centimeter lip for these poles to sit in, so they're super strong. So we're just making sure that the drill is aligned with the pole. We start drilling the hole. And once we've drilled the hole, we take a chisel and we chisel out the inside of the wood. leaving us with a nice three centimetre hole for the actual post to go into. This is a post. Now what we've done with this post is we measured the bottom of the poles and we've added six centimetres um, to the length there and then we cut it to length. Now we're trying to fit it in and it just needs a little bit of sanding down with the grinder.
and that fits straight in. Then we just push it around. So we've pushed it open um, and then we take our level, drop our level on top and see now because we're using uneven shaped wood, different types of wood, it's not perfectly level but you know it's an outdoor temporary shelter. Mark the centres of two sides so we can actually get the uh, centre position where to drill the hole and then just complete the cross. Clean the bit of all extra wood. Check the hole. You see this one is quite a lot bigger. So now we have to grind it round again. Have a look how you make it so. Ratchet is nice and tight. We get it a small drill to drop a pilot hole for the nails. This stops the wood from splitting. We just drill at a 45 degree angle. drop to nails into the <coughs> which keep it in thing. A final test is to open up the strap and there should be no movement. Yeah. So that's how we're putting the cross beams in.